Good morning, everyone. So it's Sunday morning, and I've gotten kind of a late start today because Keith and I went out of town this weekend. We went to Atlanta. We went shopping to Phipps and Lenox Square Mall, and and so I slept in uh, this morning. So we are just hanging around the house today, and Keith put in a pot of pinto beans, and I'm going to make some Mexican cornbread, you guys. And we're gonna have a good old-fashioned country dinner this evening and I'll probably fix a plate for my mom but anyway I'm just gonna do a vlog because I haven't had a lot of time to sit down and film I have a few things to show you guys so I'm gonna get my day going and I'll see you guys in a bit okay so I'm having my coffee and I think I'll have a shake and we're probably gonna eat about I would say probably about four o'clock skip lunch and uh, probably have a pretty good dinner. Um, so we went to Atlanta and I did a bit of shopping. I had no intentions in buying a bag. The only thing I really wanted to see, and if I had found it, I would have bought it, was at Gucci, the multicolor. I wanted the little small one. Um, what's it called? <laughs> The little small one to wear crossbody. Dale, you know what I'm talking about because Dale has one. Dale's addiction. Um, so I, I'm dying for that, but I could not get in Gucci because you guys, people were so rude and there was such a long line and they were cutting line and letting their friends and I just wasn't going to say anything. I'm surprised I didn't. But anyway. I said, we'll leave, we'll come back. And then every time we came back, the line was longer, so I didn't make it in Gucci. And I looked in the window and I didn't see that collection. Is that collection still available? I mean, I seriously, oh, never mind. Okay, so <laughs> I got something that I'm excited about. I got some Golden Goose, and I will open these up in a bit and show you guys what I got. So I got some sneakers, and I already have one pair, but the pair that I chose are just, like they don't look distressed. The first pair I have has the, has the distressing, I can't even talk, but these are white, and you know, it's really on trend to wear little dresses and white sneakers, so they're super comfortable and very cushiony, even more so than the first ones I have, so I got the shoes and I got some perfume, and I got a couple cute little dresses, and uh, we had a great weekend. But anyway, I'll show you guys, and in a bit, I'll go upstairs, and I'll show you what all I got when we went to uh, Destin. I haven't shown you what I got there, but anyway, you guys, okay, every time I say I'm going to Ban Island, I screw it up, so I'm not going to say that, but I am going to say there will be no more expensive purchases the rest of this year because I have to start thinking about a few Christmas gifts. We're going to have a small Christmas this year because I want to focus on the true meaning of Christmas and family, but I do have to start buying Christmas and I already have really. So, um, but yeah, no more big purchases for me. Oh, and somebody messaged me. I'm going to sit down and they said, would you explain what you meant by an accident? Okay. I wasn't trying to be funny get the lighting better okay so i wasn't trying to be funny when i said i got the bum bag and it was an accident <laughs> what happened was i had told becca a while back that i really wanted the bum bag they didn't have it available and i mean several months went by i don't know how much time but it felt like forever but anyway and i was wanting to add to my um, classic monogram collection so i had asked her for the speedy and she said they had it so she sent that and it's like literally two days later, she sent me a text and said, I've got the monogram. It's a miracle. I got, I mean, I have the monogram bum, bum bag. It's a miracle. So, um, yeah, I said, okay. <laughs> so that's how it happened. I really didn't expect to get both of those bags at once. And I wasn't trying to be funny. I know you guys probably thought I was kidding when I said I told Keith it was an accident because it kind of was, right? It kind of was, but anyway. I'm really happy that I have those pieces because when I went in Louis Vuitton, all they had was leather bags. There were two bags that I saw with monogram and they also had the leather on the sides. I don't, I can't even remember which bags they were, you guys. And I saw a few SLGs and a few full size wallets. That's it. The entire store is nothing but leather. Okay. 
And then the other Louis Vuitton at Lenox, I didn't actually go in there because there was a really long line and there wasn't anything I wanted to look at, except I did want to go in there and just see, you know, if they had monogram. But anyway, I'm telling you guys, I don't think they're ever going to totally do away with it, but then where is it? There were no speedies, there were no neverfuls, nothing classic in the boutique whatsoever. Nothing. So I saw this coming a while back, you guys. So that's why I've tried to add to my monogram collection. I'm so glad that I have. So anyway, but I'll go upstairs here, here in a little bit after I have my smoothie and I will show you guys the stuff that I got in Destin. Okay, so here we have a pot of pinto beans and then I just did some Brussels sprouts and I made two big pans of them because I just like to eat them for a snack, you guys. I'm obsessed with Brussels sprouts. So I just put some um, olive oil a little bit of garlic salt and Parmesan and then I'll put more Parmesan when they come out of the oven and I'm going to make some Mexican cornbread so I'm about to do that well I might make I might make that later because I want it to be nice and warm when we eat so anyway what else are we gonna do today I'm just now gonna have my shake and it's early afternoon so I'm gonna go ahead and do that and then I'll come back hi guys Okay, so now I'm in my office, and I just wanted to come up here and show you a few of the things that I got at the beach. So, some of the things that I got uh, were clothes. So I got some dresses, and some of you guys saw them on my Instagram. I'll probably have to do some kind of a modeling video soon, because I've had requests for that, and how I style certain bags, and then I can show off the dresses. But anyway, I went to the Coach Outlet, and I really didn't see anything that I wanted except I got this and I also got my daughter one these little mini backpacks I just love a mini backpack it's so cute and I got it really specifically to take to the football games because our colors are red red and black and I just thought it was perfect so I thought that my daughter and I could be twins I know she wants to be my twin, but anyway, so, <laughs> so I got both of us this and I got, oh, I got the little Snoopy, uh, boxy cosmetic case. Let me go get that. So I'm just, yeah, here it is. Okay. So it's in here in my closet. So I picked this up. I had so many people saying how much they loved it. This was the only one, uh, in the outlet. So I picked this up, you guys. I almost left it behind and then I walked away and then I came back and got it. And I said, I'm just going to walk around with it. I probably won't get it, but I'm just going to walk around with it. I'm so glad I got it, you guys. Ah, I'm kind of obsessed with these little things. So I have this one. So Autumn Beckman started this obsession. Okay. So last year at Christmas, she got me this one and I have used it so much, but I've used it. I put batteries in it. I put cables in it, just all kinds of stuff. Cause it's quite wide and I just absolutely love it. So I got this one and then later on, I found this one, the little ladybugs. And then I picked up this one. And then I picked up this one recently. I thought it was watercolor and Autumn said, no, I think it's tie dye. So I think she's right. I think it's listed as tie dye. So you guys, like I need another obsession. Okay. So I'm blaming, I'm blaming this new obsession on Autumn Beckman. I really want the one from the basket complex. I really want the one from the basket complex. So I'm really blaming Autumn for this, but I love these. I love them. I'm so obsessed. I just love the shape of them. So I really, I really do want the one from the basket collection. I can't even say that you guys basket, basket collection. And <laughs> okay. So anyway, Really, um, what else did I get? Really nothing. 
that's what it was. I, I, I saw the little cosmetic case. I thought, I'll just get this because I didn't see anything else in there that I wanted until I spotted this. And then I got two of these. So that's all I got at Coach. And then I went to Tory Burch and I said, I'm not going to get a bag, but I don't really think a Wallet Unchain is a bag, is it, you guys? <laughs> because that's what's in here. So let me just open it up, you guys. Okay, I'm not using a tripod right now. I'm going to lean this up against the wall. Okay. And we still have the... Keith has not taken this ladder out of here. Okay. So... I went in there to get some flip-flops and then I just changed my mind because they were $40. I just, I don't need them. So anyway, but I saw this and of course I had to have it. So let's go ahead and open it up. This is a true unbagging. All right, so it's got the, the seal on it. And I'll tell you why I got this because in, number one, I love a walk or a wallet unchain, I got it because of the color. When I saw this, I was like, I do not have a gray bag, not anymore. I had the tote, the Christian Louboutin tote, and I gave it to my daughter. And then I used to have a Michael Kors uh, handbag that was gray, and I loved it. I don't know why I sold it. I've, I've always kind of regretted that, but anyway, I did sell it a couple years ago. And so, I've always wanted something gray in my collection. So, bam, so I have this. And I love it, you guys. And what really sold me on it, well, number one, the color. And then there is the back pocket. So I can easily put my phone in there. And I have a beautiful gray walk. And another thing I loved about it, I love the silver hardware. And I also bought a pair of earrings with, you know, the Tory Burch symbol. And they're dangly. They're downstairs. And Keith's down there taking an afternoon nap. <laughs> so I won't show them to you until he wakes up. But anyway, so it matches the earrings and the... But really, I love it. And I also love the fact it's all... Okay, that needs to straighten out. So I really loved this. It's got this leather piece and it's so, mm, mm, it smells, it smells really good. Really good. Okay, so I mainly got it because of the color and I love the silver hardware. So that's what I got at Tory Burch and a pair of earrings and that was it. So the rest of the stuff that I got when we were at the beach uh, was the dresses. I got several dresses, so I will show those to you guys because I do need to do a video where I style my, um, I'll style this and uh, I will style this and then I've had requests to style my bum bag and my speedy, so I will do that when I show off the dresses, so that'll be another video, okay? It's okay, little Autumn Junior, don't cry. Mm. <laughs> I'm getting carried away. So, yeah, I'm so excited about this. Oh, I just love it. Okay, we'll go back downstairs and I will show you guys the earrings that I got. Hey, you guys, look at my closet. Okay, it's a mess. My little cosmetic pouch fell. But anyway, you see all those boxes that I have just stacked on top of each other? So, Keith is going to order me another shelf to go in the middle there because, yeah, your girl is running out of space. You guys, down in the corner down there is my large Kurt Geiger bag that I've never used. I even forgot it was there. So anyway, yeah, uh, as soon as he orders that, we'll do a little bit of remodeling in here. I need a little more space because um, here's my coach area. And see, for some reason, I'm obsessed with coach in this color. And that's why I when I got the backpack, I almost got this color, but I thought I'm going to get a red one. So anyway, I love coach in this color. All right. So here is my Tory Burch walk and the matching Tory Burch earrings that I bought. See, I just, I couldn't pass it up because normally 
The hardware is gold and I just love this gray with the silver hardware and then these earrings are almost the exact same size, a little bit smaller than the logo. So I thought that would be absolutely gorgeous together. So that's what I picked up. Okay guys, so I am planning on doing a handbag collection video not this month probably next month since the year is coming to a close I'll just kind of quickly they're not all in here so I'm just gonna quickly give you guys a glimpse in here and I would like to put some more lights up in here and just a quick glimpse okay and then up here are my colorful bags because my bags that aren't quite as pricey um, I tend to be a little braver with those so I can get the color that I love but with more pricey bags I tend to buy more classics but anyway so yeah so I've got a lot of stuff in here to move around and I need more space for my bags you guys my boot obsession is real, okay? And, yeah, it's real. <laughs> and there's my Gucci high tops that I have not worn yet. I'm excited to wear those. So anyway, at some point we're going to add another, a little narrow shelf there. We've already figured out what we want, so hopefully we'll do that soon. Hi, guys. Okay, it's Monday, it is Labor Day, and it is 12.44, and I have been in the kitchen, you guys. It's a miracle. Let me show you what I made. So, my son has COVID, but he's a lot better, and uh, so I'm gonna take some food down there and just drop it off. So, I made some spaghetti sauce. So, I wanted to make something that the girls would like. So, I'm gonna make some spaghetti and some yeast rolls, okay? And then I always make these cookies that my family, I've been making them for years, chocolate oatmeal cookies. I think they go by different names, but anyway, I made that for the girls. And then we have some leftover vegetables from yesterday and I'm taking a big bunch of food to my sister and her husband. And you guys, I just feel like a Martha Stewart type today or something, it's so rare. <laughs> Keith was like, look at you trying to be all domesticated. Okay, I'm gonna prop this up. Okay, so anyway, I feel like a food truck because I'm gonna take some food over to my sister and then I'm gonna come back and make the spaghetti and then drop it off for them and go by the store if they need something. I'm gonna gather up the cookies, package those up, and then I'm gonna come back and show you guys my golden goose. Remember I said I got those in um, Atlanta? So. I got those. I'm excited. I have not opened them since I tried them on, so I'll be back in just a minute. Hey, Keith. What do you have to say? Nothing. Hey. You what got do you us? want me to say? <laughs> okay, guys. So, we have been gone all day long. I have been like a delivery food girl. Like, I cooked... <laughs> And I delivered food to my son and his family. And then I took food to my sister. She's not sick. I just took her some leftovers. <laughs> and we've been gone all day. And I got myself a roasted chicken from the deli. And you guys, you're not going to believe what happened. Okay. So, I went and got a roasted chicken. And then, this is just so ironic, right? So, then we were pulling out and we almost got smacked by a chicken truck. I'm not kidding. I just felt like that was really ironic, really weird, but anyway, you know. <laughs> it's not funny, it's not funny. <laughs> Keith almost pulled out in front of a chicken truck and I'm not kidding. Okay, so it is 6.03, 6.03. So I'm gonna open up uh, my Golden Goose that I just showed you guys, so let me run and get it. I'll be right back. Okay guys, so this is what I got when we went to Atlanta over the weekend. Um, 
and then I got some perfume. But let me just go ahead and open these. And I got them because they're so comfortable. And I already have one pair of Golden Goose. And I love them. But the pair that I got, they are not distressed. And I thought they would be super cute. I think I already told you guys this with a little dress. So, anyway. Here's the box. And I'm going to do a styling video pretty soon. Um, and style these shoes, some of my new dresses, and things like that. Okay, so some kind of a dust bag came with it. And the pair that I got are just, they're just white. Just white. Nice, clean looking sneakers, but what I really like, look at the back of them. They have sparkle, silver sparkles. It says Golden Goose. And they're very cushy, very, very comfortable. Super cute, you guys. Super cute. So, yeah, this is what I got when we went to Atlanta. Love these, love these. So, I told Autumn and Winnie that I'm not going to be buying any more big purchases. <laughs> I know you guys believe it, but seriously, like big, big purchases. I'm not saying I won't buy something small or, you know, but no more bags or anything this year because I really went over my quota this year and I'm going to start, I have like four birthdays, four or five birthdays to buy for in October. So I have to do that. And then November birthday, December birthdays and Christmas. So yeah, the end of the year is up on us. Okay, so that's really all I have for this vlog. I just wanted to show you guys these. And these are true to size. So I got a size 38. Yes, size 38. And I wear a seven and a half and eight. And they are perfect, you guys. Thanks for spending time with me, taking time out of your day to watch me. Don't forget to subscribe. I always forget to say all that stuff. Subscribe, let's get, a fi let's get to 5,000 subscribers so I can give away that Chanel mirror. I'm excited to do that. So anyway, I'll see you guys in a couple of days. Bye-bye, peace.